founder of jenniferbradley.com. I design, develop, and manufacture skincare and cosmetics for people with very hypersensitive skin. It definitely was not my first choice in, uh, as a profession or career. I thought I was going to be a performer, and that's what I used to do. I didn't make colors for my skin tone or people who had darker skin tones. It's kind of like they only made makeup for people right in this one segment of the population. Anyone who had darker skin tone or anyone who had really fair skin, no, we didn't have foundation colors that would match our skin. And I didn't really think that was fair. Not, not just for me, but for my clients of color. So I started mixing and creating my own products a long, long time ago. The other job I did was makeup artistry. And after about working in the industry for about five years, it started to be this thing where people would sit in my chair over and over and over again and say, I have highly sensitive skin. Nothing works for me. I'm very concerned about the products that you're going to be using on me. The thing that makes my company different is that we're not trying to sell people a lot of products. We're trying to focus more on their skin and their skincare. I wanted to help people get answers and get real solutions for their skin that were cost effective, something that would give them a lifetime of great skin. And I actually created that myself. And that's why I'm so passionate about it is because I have seen one-on-one -on -one from when I was actually doing makeup in person on a client. When they would, I would just do a makeover on it. You could see that transformation from someone who was shy and hurt and sad and felt bad about themselves to, oh my gosh, I look amazing. And then after they started to use my skincare, then they didn't even have to have the makeup to feel amazing. Like they could just be themselves and feel great about themselves. That is the most empowering thing and most beautiful thing. It's a gift that I'm able to give to other people and I'm obsessed. I still can't believe I, what I, that I'm doing what I'm doing, but I am and it's really cool.